Here he is. What's happening behind you uh, for? I, goat yoga, I think. Oh, there's, there's behind goats? me. See the goats? Oh. Yeah. Oh, there are goats in there. Yeah, we're at Desert Ridge High School. Thursday. Yeah, look at this. It's as though the Rockettes suddenly teamed up with a herd of small goats. Uh, this is great. April Gould is with us. And April, give me an idea of what in the world we're seeing here. This is not your average PE class. No, it's not your average class. This is Mandala Goats Yoga. So right now they're just joining in circle. This helps bring the community together. Yeah, it does. <laughs> How fun. Well, th there's something about it. We have just a few seconds, and we'll get more time later. Something about a, a baby goat I know. that everyone loves. Am I They're right? therapy animals. How could you not be happy? Look at these girls. They're all laughing yeah. and having a good time. Yeah, ladies, next time you fly, we're just going to get vests for these things. You just take them right into the cabin. Um, uh, when did you start this program with the school? How did that happen? You know, this is the first time I really liked Lena's story. She just finished her last round of chemo, and she could have taken the year off, but she just loves her Lynn students. Lena's the teacher here. This is a teacher, yes, and she just loved her students so much that we had to come. I love it. Well, how now I see we're doing a kick line at the moment. Yes. How are the goats going to be involved in uh, the rest of the class today? Well, next uh, we're going to have them all on their hands and knees, and the goats are going to run around their back. I would like to see that. Oh, yeah. Everyone does. All right. More coming your way from Desert Ridge High School. It's goat yoga. It doesn't happen at every school, but these lucky girls are going to enjoy it. More coming your way in just a couple of minutes. AZAM is back. Oh, <laughs> that's the spot right there. <laughs> wow. A little to the left. It feels yeah, good. I know. Yeah, kind of a nice massage. It's almost like you can feel it right now, right? Ooh, if only. those girls have two on their back. Yeah. Goat yoga. Desert Ridge High School in Mesa. They're getting quite the treat today. Are they trained to do that? Um, They've got to be, right? They must be because they're not yeah. slipping down. Or Look at this one over here making the rounds. How does one train a goat <laughs> to walk on some? All right, so uh, Corey now is out for us, and uh, wh whoever the creator was obviously had something like this in mind when they <laughs> created goats. <laughs> Absolutely. Look, it's April Gould. She knows all about goats and goat yoga. Oh, yeah, these are some of her assistants, and we're out at, uh, oh, look, at it's home of the Jaguars. Desert Ridge, who loves the Jags? <laughs> Oh, that's what we're talking about. All right, let's race these goats. Down you go, ladies. More coming your way from Goat Yoga Day in just a couple of minutes. All right, Corey is out in Desert Ridge High School in Mesa. Goat Yoga. Let's do it. Hey, yeah. Cor. Go Desert Ridge. Hey, good morning. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, this room is electrified i mean electrified you have not seen this kind of action in this uh, activity room in quite a while uh, we're talking about goat yoga april gould is the expert and well april's up here and let me ask you a question when you got to school today did you have any idea that this might be happening to you yes oh really yes. you had a weird dream yes oh. this dream was amazing. Yeah, I'll bet it was. Uh, is it a therapeutic uh, exercise for you? How do you feel with the hooves plowing into your back? It feels nice. Oh, does it really? Yeah. Do you have any pets at home? Yeah. I any hoof stock? No. You know, cows, donkeys? No. No. Very good. Well, April, pop in here if you would. We like to uh, get an expert's uh, perspective on all of this. I won't even ask you how you came up with the idea. I assume it was a fever dream of some kind. Uh, but uh, you must get a terrific response from people, not just here at the school, but all over. What do they love about it? Uh, it just is so much fun and therapeutic, and it just brings goat yoga together. And it, I mean, look at this. Look into his eyes. Like, how can you not? Who, be who happy? could not be happy who seeing this? little girl or guy who is this by the this way this is bugsy oh bugsy yes, yes. he's a house goat <laughs> <laughs> i love the idea that there is such a thing as a house goat yeah <laughs> and um how how old will bugsy be when he is retired from the goat yoga game our goats never retire we think they're cute at every single age and so they continue to do goat yoga wow 
Well, I imagine if you get a 70-pound goat right in your lumbar region, it's got to be helpful. <laughs> when they get bigger, we teach them to go under people. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. Now, d does does this happen occasionally? Uh, it looks like raisinets or snickers. I'm not. Are they goobers? What's happening over here? Um, yeah, that happens sometimes. That's, That's just nature, right? <laughs> are you aware of what's happening up on yeah. your back? Yeah, I yeah. Did you imagine this would happen when you get off the bus today? Yeah, no. no Probably not. All right, well, Is she well, happy you're very that it kind happens? to uh, stick around for it. She must be yeah, glad. watch your hands there. Yeah. <laughs> well, again, Troy, you grew up on a farm, I believe. No, I, I read your bio, and you're probably I used to this kind of farm. Boy. Just like you, I was in the suburbs. <laughs> well, before we go, April, if uh, if you want to get your own crowd involved in goat yoga, how can they get in touch with you? So you just go to goatyoga.com, and we have classes periodically throughout the week, and we just have so much fun. Oh, gosh, I love it. All right, April Gould, she's brought the fun out here to Desert Ridge High School, home of the what? The Jaguars. There they are. We'll see you again soon, everybody. The goat's relatively calm through all those screams. They're staying right <laughs> yeah, there on their backs, too. Yeah. That's good stuff. Wow.